what up? I actually did find where I spit on your grave site is. The gas station and also the cabin and the store that she stopped at. The original title was Day of the Woman. Changed my broken spoke. That's broken spoke number two for me. I still get a lot of questions asking about the hawk of people that are interested in buying one. And they're gun shy about buying Chinese product, which they should be. But, you know, I have to say that this, the Hawk's actually been pretty good. It's had a few issues. I think probably the main thing is the bolts loosening up. I had the two broken spokes. I had one stud break on my exhaust. I didn't do a video on that. I should have. My speedometer cable caught. It never broke. But it kept catching on my horn. Rerouted my clutch cable because it was, they were kind of short on the first generation Hawks. Other than that, I don't think I really had much go wrong with this. Oiled my chain up. That's a must do maintenance item. I also changed the view of my GoPro, so what do you think? I always did the ultra wide. Figure I'd give this a shot. A lot of times it looks like I'm so much farther behind the car or whatever object I'm behind. And if I try to zoom cut, it's blurry because it is a wider view so let's see how this works I also raised my frame rate back up to 60 I don't know how it ended up back at 24 so right now I'm at 1080 P 60 wide view so I spit on your grave 1978 love that movie as a kid as you all know I'm a movie buff and I really like horror movies I try to catch the same angle that they did in the movie then I'm going to take you guys to a sand pit someone told me about. Pretty local. They got a little track. I know you guys that ride on the beach or live in Florida or sandy areas, it's definitely a little tougher to ride in the sand. A little tidbit. Gas was 63 cents when we were filming this movie. So this is it. They took the gas pumps out. That's the gas station. You can see where the gas pumps were. And I'll take you to the cabin that she stayed in. There it is. Pretty cool. I can see why they have so many cameras people like me go looking for it <laughs> oh, when I went to look at the cabin I had 666 holy shit that's creepy that's not how many miles I have on I had 1600 oh that's a big black snake god damn be alive Oh yeah, he's alive. You better get off the road, buddy. He might get it. Oh yeah. Shit. Now he's really pissed off. Good. Did my good Samaritan for the day. So as I was saying, I don't know if I got to finish. I don't have 668 miles on my bike right now. I had 1600 miles when I changed the odometer. So that comes out to what, 2268? Back tire is already kind of worn out. I'm gonna have to replace it. That's because I do more road riding than I'd like. So now I'm coming into the town of Kent, and if you recall in a movie, I'll show you where the monument is. That monument right there. So the country store that she stopped in, we're coming up on it, right there. Later on, 
down in the movie, you can watch a kid ride the bicycle right up through town this way. That's it. If you haven't seen the movie and you're into horror, go check it out. I spit on your grave house again. There's a movie in there too. I left all their fucking garbage. Look at that. Jesus Christ. It's nice what they did over the weekend, huh? All that freaking garbage. Horrible. They're having like a huge party, the music was playing. And this is the shit they did at Bulls Bridge. It is gross. And what do they think? Someone's supposed to come pick up after them? Exactly. And they wonder why all the shit gets shut down. I should have rode down in here and took a video. <laughs> you know? Have a good one. That is fucked up. Because over a Bulls Bridge, you used to be able to park right, right on the other side of the bridge. It was a pull-off and everything. And people started coming. And they started having parties. They freaking ruined it for everybody else. You bring in your garbage, you bring out your garbage. Well, they're selling that property. That's where I went through where all the homeless are. It's overgrown a bit. Someone was up here with a golf cart. Riding in the sands like having a flat tire. <laughs> Been a while. Unless I got a flat tire. It's a big one. Got the torque. Gonna make it up this one. Oh, I made it. Barely. Finders keepers. Never know if I got a road rage. <laughs> I'm kidding. No thing but a chicken wing. I ain't looking in that. Uh uh. That was fun. She did good. I don't think I've ridden in sand on a motorcycle 
in over 20 years. <laughs> riding on sand's like riding with a flat tire. Fun. Came right back to me. Like riding a bike. <laughs> I cracked myself up. He's a big one. This is a little rubbery. It feels good. Hey. What are you doing? Hey. <laughs> he don't give a shit. No. And what is he doing anyway? It's like he has no purpose. He's just fine wandering around. Why isn't he eating all our berries? Here he goes. Right down. Wow.